Ah! I yelled this time. Taylor Holder doesn't know who Bryce Hall is. Talk about, I don't know who that is, man. I feel like, okay, okay, okay. Well, that's that. Why did he say it like, I don't even know who that is. And then they're like, yeah, I feel that. It is just absolutely hilarious to me that he reaches out to all these like outlets to interview him to promote his like shitty auto-tuned music just for him to be asked about me. Fuck you. Actually, you had a response to this yeah, video though. already. And which... you know that was my genuine response. I will never be friends with Bryce Hall again or anyone else who did not have a side back in January. Oh no. <laughs> Do you think you guys are ever gonna be friends? Dude, I'm hoping, right? <laughs> that was sarcasm. Not I don't know, man. I feel like maybe. Shut up. <laughs> I think you guys are gonna never be friends ever. Not a chance. You, 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 you actually you like to comment about that. This I week. did. Yeah, people caught were commenting. They're like, "Oh, you guys watched it, and Jaden and Josh will be friends again." And I like to reply that said, "Well, no." Ah, I give it time. Oh. No, no amount of time. Everyone's saying no behind the scenes right here, but <laughs> you're doing yeah. I feel like maybe yeah, yeah, yeah. Might, everyone there's around here is, 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 is not in there. No, but I think so. Completely different scenario. I think so. I okay. think so. Oh, oh. You should still be hey, friends. Look. All right, well, talking about, you know. A whole lot of nothing. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> um, Thomas Petro got into a fight with two 40 year olds because apparently this man and woman threw stuff at Thomas's car. Then the drunk woman proceeded with her boyfriend to start threatening Mia and Tabitha Swatosh. Apparently those two adults hated those hype house kids. Okay, re re like respect, but like why post that on your Instagram? You're totally posting it. You're probably making a whole YouTube video about it. When have Good I ever Samaritan. put on a fight on my social media? Anthony, if Bryce got into a fight, does he talk about it on social media? Oh, if he got into a fight, thank you, dude. Thank you, dude. You, dude. Like Thomas Petro, as soon as- Ah! He just, he just ah! Like, as soon as it happens, as soon as it happens, he's like, Yo, I, I would fight, guys. <laughs> I, like, I would not put it on my Instagram feed. Yo, so what do you think about Thomas posting about this fight stuff right now? I'm, I'm gonna be honest, I just laughed when I saw it. I was like, either nobody really needed to know. I mean, <laughs> like, but I mean, it's cool, I guess. I mean, it's cool yeah. that he defended a girl. Yeah, yeah no, like, I, I actually, I'm gonna move. be honest, I didn't even know the full story. I just saw that he posted that he got in a fight as soon as he got in a fight, and I was like, I, I, know, I didn't read I just, that whole I just swiped. Oh, I didn't read the caption. Yeah, it was like, I just saw I got in a I fight, and I, was fight like, and I was like, Let's look at all the things that Kiwa has time to do while he is getting his girlfriend's getting ready. That was a fucking bad transition. Did he really just try to sneak that one in? Hey, he, he knew that was gonna get Oh, he knew, he knew it was gonna get the views, eh? Yeah. yeah, like I posted mine knowing that was gonna get like- Yeah, I know. That's exactly, all of you guys are just clout chasing off. Should you. I do it? Oh no, like I- Should I, I start? I, I fully- <laughs> No! Uh oh, I didn't start no. it. Dude, it gets likes. It gets it, likes. It I don't get like care. Views. It does get like like I'm views. gonna I'm gonna like start doing that way more. <laughs> just, keep, just, keep hooking, just, that. just keep hooking up with random girls. And then publicizing it. So I, I don't publicize it. It gets publicized. Because I, I need content. <laughs> Talking about me not posting about shit. I had a little fucker follow me around on a dog walk this you week. Definitely, you definitely had someone do that for you. Anthony, have we ever been photographed on a walk before in our lives? Zero times. Zero fucking times, bro. Imagine that wasn't Nessa, though. Yeah, I think that ship has already sailed. I can really <laughs> I mean, convince people But, like, what if you, like, double down and just be like, that wasn't even Nessa? Well, I already said it was. <laughs> talking talking about, uh, about Nessa. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Bree commented on Nessa's post. She put a little eye thing. I don't know what that means. Maybe they're flirting. They could be. They could be. Would they you could Would be. you be pissed if Bree started dating Nessa? Dude, that would be crazy. Um, would I be pissed? Probably not. So Ness commented this to a fan. They said, are you going on this podcast? And she said, no. This podcast meant specifically this week's podcast. Secondly, she actually deleted that comment since posting. I don't think she actually wants to come on whatsoever. I think she's going to come on. I hope. I hope. One day. Anyway, Celtics. Oh, the basketball game is on. Talking about basketballs. Talking about balls. Jordan Jones' exes posted oh, his balls on TikTok. He didn't, but it would have been a way better of a transition <laughs> if he did. All right, Jordan Jones' ex posted this on TikTok and like comments about it. Let's go see what this is. Oh, so he oh. finally calls her out. It's about damn time. He liked that comment. When Ooh. she finally finds a man she can trust. Dude, they were stress. they were together for like three years. Mad time. What a piece of shit. Who? Which one? I'm just gonna let anyone interpret it. That. Ah. <laughs> you are picking a side just in your own head. In oh, your yeah. mental. No, I said it out loud. Someone is a piece of shit in this scenario. Though. Yeah, there's a piece of shit for sure. Who do you think he thinks is a piece of shit? Because I think this guy probably wants some pussy, so he's gonna uh, say Jordan. <laughs> okay, so yeah, Jordan's a piece of shit. Well, they're both named Jordan. <laughs> Jordan is a piece of shit, though. 
That'd be fucked up if you were calling the girl Jordan a piece of shit. It'd be fucked up Why if you were calling the guy Why is it fucked up to call the girl a piece, piece of shit versus the guy? I feel like that's calling that's like calling a girl a bitch. What do you mean? Yeah, we, we can make fun of guys. But we can't make fun of girls? I feel like that's you sick. make fun of girls. That's kind of sexist. When have I ever that's kind of sexist. <laughs> that's kind of sexist to say you that can't make sexist. fun of girls, but you can make Yo, fun of guys. Not, not what you think girls can't handle it? Do you hey, think hey, girls can't hey, handle hey, the hey, guests? Hey, 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 girls. Are you saying that you're sensitive? Girl, girls, say, yeah. same playing field. Girls want the same that's rights. Up, Everything's dude. equal between man and woman, so you can talk the same shit. Yeah, bro. Josie refollowed Jaden. Of course. Okay, 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 okay. Landon unfollowed Nessa too. I seen this. Wait, what? Yeah. Really? Talking about no relationship way. shit. No way. Yeah, dude. Crazy, right? Mads is dating uh, Kevin. I don't know. Well, I was live. I was live before I went on AMP today. I was live on Instagram and I guessed her. I was like, oh, what are you up to today, Mads? And she's like, oh, I'm just getting picked up in like a few minutes. And I was like, who are you getting picked up by? And she was like, oh, just a friend. And I go, a male or female friend? And she goes, it's a male. And then I was like, oh, it's gotta be this Kevin dude from Dog. Yeah, no, dude, that is actually so crazy. I mean, I fuck with Kevin, dog. I know, I do too, Kevin's but I, w I wouldn't expect him to do it. Like, Matt. Matt. No, I didn't see that in a billion years. Yeah, no, years. I would have never seen that coming. <laughs> So the picture of them, I think at like something like Disneyland or Universal or some shit like that. So someone comments, Americans are so weird thinking 20 and 30 is a weird age to be together. It's literally not. Both are adults. And then Kevin went, someone pinned, pinned this. this. Is, is Kevin 30? I think he's like 29 or 28. So what's the distance? Yeah, I mean, it, yeah. But it's not like she's like 18. Yeah, I know. If it was 18, that'd be weird. She's 20. My like papa, if, if, my if papa like... Harry was 89. My grandma was 60. I'm just saying. Right. It's kind of normal. My 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 sixty. Yeah. My grandparents are like twelve years. Apart. I guess once you get to that age, it's like it's like there's it's no very way. different, yeah. right? Like yeah, like yeah. your your grandpa scored. Oh yeah, big yeah. time. Yeah, he was a G. He was a G. Was a G. Yeah, she was hot. <laughs> Yo, wait a minute. What about my granny? Yeah. What are you saying about the what are you saying about man? my granny? I said she's she's cute. Yeah, my gaming is cute. All right, weird way to end it. Why is Gav starting the fucking tea talk weird and, and ending it, it weird? weird. Um, um, our hopefully our you guys distract. liked the video. Our diss track comes in <laughs> on Gavin. Oh my God! All right, thank you guys for watching the tea talk. Yeah, yeah. Now I'm gonna go to Dior. Peace. Is this the same clip twice? No, it's a different clip. Damn, I, I fucked up. This guy has a modeling shoot. This guy has Dior to go to, Gav. Yeah, like I am going to Dior. Man. This guy's like a Dior guy now. We can't have Dior guys on the like show we have, we have like and then MCM. not treat them like they're Dior guys. We have MCM and Dior over here. And you're, you're... We got MCM and Dior.